DuPage County DOT has over a thousand lane miles of paved surface that we have to maintain. The county is divided into 10 plow routes. Each plow route has anywhere from three to four drivers on that route. Those route sizes range from 88 to 136 miles each. A usual uh, storm, we have 28 to 30 trucks out. Uh, larger storms, we have 34 to 37. We have three salt domes, two on campus in Wheaton and one remote facility in Woodridge. Uh, combined, they hold 16,000 tons of salt. So typically, when we know that there will be a weather event, depending on the type of event, we may send trucks out to pre-treat the roads. If it is going to start off as rain, we don't send anybody out but we try to get trucks onto the road two hours prior to the actual snowfall or ice falling because it gives our guys a chance to get some type of treatment application onto the plow routes before it actually starts falling because the main purpose of salt and de-icers is to not allow the ice to bond to the pavement. So when we can get out there ahead of time, it makes it so much easier. And when it does start to collect, plowing it off is a lot easier because you have something that doesn't allow the frozen material to bond to the pavement. So during plowing operations, uh, we're either running singles or we're running in tandem. So there could be one truck, there could be up to four trucks. Uh, typically, we will start and we will clean the centers and we will clean left to right. So the lead truck will always be towards the center. Uh, if he's alone, he might be moving in that lane a little bit, but always trying to clear that center first, working left to right. Now, if you're in a group of trucks, um, you know, two, three, or four, they're gonna be uh, stacked behind that lead truck, and that lead truck isn't going to be able to see very well behind him. So, sometimes we have vehicles that try to pass the plow trucks and get in between us, and that's a dangerous situation for everybody. It's important for the public to understand that during an emergency, which this is an emergency vehicle, that we're out there trying to clean the roads and help the public get to their destination. One of the big misconceptions I think people have is that they say we don't have a snowplow going by our house or we haven't seen a snowplow all night. What they don't realize is during a major event, it could take up to four hours for us to make one pass because our routes are pretty large. Uh, I mean, the business mis misconceptions are we're, we don't want to take your mailbox down, we don't want to cover your driveway, we're not going 50 miles per hour, we're going 20, 25 miles per hour because if we go any faster, it would be too dangerous and we're just trying to keep you guys safe. 